Hi, welcome to my day. So, I haven't done a video on my garden in a while. Things got a little out of control with camp and camping and school starting and soccer starting and all the things. Sorry. Um, but today I don't have any ki extra kids and my kids are at school and I needed to tackle the garden. The weeds are getting out of control and I was watching some YouTubes and I heard that uh, if I plant now, early September, I can have some of the colder weather crops. So I'm going to try to tear out maybe some basil, um, all the weeds, there's parsley and cilantro. I might plant more cilantro, I heard that one's okay to do. This is zucchini and the weeds got crazy and the beetles took over. Let's see, I picked the last, well, my husband picked the last of the zucchini today, last night. Um, because I had stopped picking them, but this grass has gotten out of control. So I'm going to do away with the zucchini since the beetles and, um, here they are. These beetles were all over them. So I kind of just stopped doing stuff with it because they were just infested. You see them in there? So I'm going to pick those out and plant carrots and red beets. My green beans are producing well now. My second batch of green beans and over there. My asparagus is a little crazy. I might get a rope and just tie them up because they're like massively falling over. <laughs> so anyways, I'm going to plant, let's see, lettuce, cilantro, carrots, and red beets yet. And we'll see how a later crop does for those. Um, but yeah, this lettuce bolted because it was too hot. My potatoes are doing well and my other red beets that I planted are doing well. So I might pick those soon. But um, I didn't actually try for a second crop of potatoes. I kind of just left some in the ground and they kind of took off. So yeah, we'll see how it looks later. Well, I think I'm finished for today. My back hurts to stand up. I'm sweating and I'm covered in dirt. And I'm shaking because I'm hungry. See my dirty legs? I decided to uh, climb under the uh, asparagus to get the weeds out. But I uh, planted some sugar peas here. We did it. Planted uh, red beets here. I already have some red beets and potatoes. Planted lettuce here and, and cilantro. And I'm trying to try this worm compost box that my neighbor told me about. It's got holes in it the whole way down. And then you just throw your compost in it and the worms from your garden go in there and break it down. And I weeded around my peppers. And I weeded in my asparagus. Look, now it's like a tunnel in there. You can see through. I should turn my camera around. I can't really tell what you can see. So, my hair's a hot mess. I'm super dirty and I gotta get a shower before Miles gets home from school. These are my peanuts plants. I can't wait to see if they will work. I, um, uh, you have to wait till the tops die off, I guess, to know if they're ready. Oh, and I planted carrots over here in, ooh, ooh, ah! in my wash baskets. Um, see if those work in there this year. And I found a lantern that somebody lit and let float away and it landed in my yard. Oh, my goodness. These are the weeds I pulled and the zucchini. I'm gonna let them dry and then run them over with a lawnmower and or burn the bigger ones and or chop them up and put them in the compost. And my next job will be tackling this hot mess because 
it wasn't vegetables. So I let it go and it got out of hand. Well, the corn was in there, but Dave chopped it down since it was done. So, how's your garden growing? How are your weeds? You know what? It's okay if they get out of hand. If you're taking care of your family, that's more important, right? So, perspective. The weeds will be there tomorrow, although they'll be bigger and possibly harder to pull and get rid of. Every year I say next year will be different. I won't let them get so big, but there's a lot of space here that I have to pull. Anyways, I need some water. So, thanks for watching. Uh, you were made on purpose and God loves you. Share your smile with others. And uh, sorry I'm gross, but have a good day. Thanks for watching. <laughs>